Wait a minute. What? 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 Oh, I'm going to break it down. I'm about to blow your mind with the information about Blackstone, so stay till the very end. This is freaking me out. It's almost funny how much I'm getting banned right now, so look at my pinned videos. Both pinned videos have a ton of views. The one that does not have any views is the one you should watch because that's what they're trying to keep from you. That's my hint. Now let's get to the Blackstone information. Blackstone beats genetic privacy suit over ancestry acquisition. So Blackstone now owns all the genetic information you send to them if you ever were like, I wanna find out where I'm from, ancestry.com. Blackstone Incorporated defeated a proposal, class action, alleging that it's $4.7 billion acquisition of Ancestry.com. $4.7 billion to own your DNA. Sounds like a deal to me. Uh, the U.S. Court of Appeals for the Seventh Circuit said Monday that plaintiffs Carolyn Bridges and Raymond Cunningham, good for them, by the way, that they even did this lawsuit. They just didn't have enough information. The court affirmed a lower court's dismissal of the lawsuit for failure to state a claim. That just means you got a bad lawyer or you're not really doing it right. But just in case... You guys gave your DNA away because you wanted to know if your ancestors were from Britain or Ireland. They own you now. And with this awesome genetic manipulation called the <coughs> mRNA, you don't think that that all kind of comes together right now?